I mean, I know the mods will love, would like to ask probably why what it was like riding a Jimmy scooter, or riding a Jimmy scooter and getting back on a Lambretta after um, all these years. It was, I mean, getting back on the scooter was great fun. And for the Kickstarter um, campaign, I got on Jimmy's scooter. I rode Jimmy's scooter, the one from Quadrophenia, which of course is now over 40 years old, like all of us. And forgotten, forgotten how unique they are to ride. Um, it's the smell of the two-stroke initially, which, which just brings back instant memories. I think anybody that's ridden a two-stroke scooter just knows that smell it connects you directly with 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 some memories but i ride a motorbike and everything on the scooter seems to be kind of backwards you rely on the back brake not the front brake um the the, the, the gears are here of course it's got a twist grip here so it's actually as compared with a modern machine it's quite difficult to ride especially with a pillion because they're light machines um i i drive I ride a, a, a Thunderbird Storm, which is you know quite a heavy piece of machinery, which is a cruiser type motorcycle. So coming down to a scooter was um, was great, but I jumped on it and it was just like uh, yeah, it was like hello old friend. It was great fun. Lambrettas are slightly different. Was that Lambretta? I can't remember now. That was a Vespa. I don't know, but that was just just great fun. Just great. anything on two wheels really that moves is um, is great. And there was that scene which I think you thoroughly enjoyed, and it was a highlight, going on Brighton Pier, <coughs> riding on Brighton Pier, which was... I yeah, I, I mean, I think, I think the highlight of the film for me was to, to be able to ride a scooter on Brighton Pier with Josh on the back, because that was just thrilling, that was great fun, and we did it several times, and we did it with the public there, um, so we surprised them quite a few times, which was, I uh, couldn't think of that fast. But they let us do it, you know, which was surprising because back in the day, back in 1978, when we made Quadrophenia, the, the counts were actually quite against us. And it's just funny how, how because, you know, Quadrophenia is so intrinsically linked with Brighton and there's, there's pilgrimages of mods down to Brighton every year for maybe four or five weekends of the year. Uh, they show Quadrophenia on the beach in, in August and on the August bank holiday, it's become a sort of a regular feature. Um, how attitudes have changed towards sort of modism, if you like. Um, but just a great, great fun. Who wouldn't? Who wouldn't want to ride a ride a motorcycle, you know, a scooter on Brighton Pier? It was great. Is it was it kind of strange going back to I mean going back to putting on a parker and um doing, I, doing Playing a character. Oh, I mean, that, 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 I mean, the difficult thing is, of course, is that I'm, I'm playing a character who was a character in Quadrophenia when I was in Quadrophenia, yeah. playing a character that's playing a character that was in Quadrophenia. Um, so it's a kind of, oh, it's just, it's just one of those things, and he's just, he's just another character, and he just happened to be. I mean, Quadrophenia for me was so long ago now that it's like another lifetime. It's something that I've, I've kind of, I'll, you never forget an experience like that. But it's, but it's so far in the distant past now that. Uh, I look at Godrefine like looking at a different person, and although we're still friends, I, you know, it's it, I'm that far removed from it that it's, it's it's like it's completely separate to me now. So you approach it like any other part. You look at the character. You look at you look at you know the, the the dynamics of the character between the characters. You look at the relationships, and you just approach it like that. You do it with an actor's eye instead of just being, you know, just just kind of throwing yourself into it like we did in Quadrophenia. Um so yeah, I mean, I mean, part of the reason the film got made is because of its associations with Quadrophenia. Um, not forgetting that the film was financed um, was, was financed privately through you know crowdfunding um, through the mod basically the mod world wanted this film made, which is uh, yeah, which is commendable. Um, Character-wise, just another character, really. You do the work within that framework. But I must say, I mean, that day we actually filmed down in Brighton in the cafe uh, with all the scooters lined up and we rode around sort of Brighton on the scooters. That was, that was, I loved that. And it looks fabulous. I think it looks fabulous on film. It was great fun.